I'm actually going to be doing a video on three goals that I have this year for myself. And I know that doesn't seem like a lot and I know, you know, it's not a lot to some people, but I feel like, you know, even just having one goal is better than not having anything at all. And I just wanted to share that with you. I'm pretty sure no one's really going to watch this, but I just want to put it out there anyways, just in case, you know, anyone's feeling kind of like down or not having any motivation for anything. Maybe this will give you motivation to find some type of goal for yourself and accomplish it. And maybe it'll, you know, make you feel feel way better. That's probably the reason why I'm doing it. And yeah, so my three goals for this year are I want to be more mentally happy. Just because, you know, I say I'm a stay-at-home mom and I'm literally at home 24-7. So it's, it is very depressing. I know to some people it isn't because they like to be at home. But I'm not that type of person. I've never been that type of person until I had my kids. I've always been the type of person that, you know, I was always go, 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 let's go you know, let's go sit outside in the grass and enjoy it, let's um, go for hikes and things like that. And I really can't with my kids just because most of the time it's just myself and then, you know, one is five and the other one is four and it's kind of hard to, t to watch both of them. They're both so hyper and it's just like one's pulling me one way and one's pulling me the other way. So it's kind of hard for me to actually like enjoy anything because I'm so busy with them. And literally for the last five um well it's gonna be six years because my daughter's gonna be six already six years i have been putting myself last so i'm gonna try to you know put myself first in this category which is my mental health and which is my happiness my personal happiness and when i say that i don't mean like i'm gonna not do things with my kids i just i'm just saying i'm gonna try to you know have like maybe an hour to myself where it's just for me i it doesn't even matter what it is if it's going outside and just taking a walk or going to get my nails done whatever it is I'm gonna try to do that and then the next um, thing which is you know kind of leading kind of correlating with the first one it's going um, and doing more outdoor activities just because I miss being outside like you guys don't understand how much I love nature <laughs> and not being outside it was really depressing so I want to just get back into being around nature and just smelling and touching and just enjoying what is out in front of me and a lot of times a lot of people don't appreciate that because they're just stuck at home and on their phones 24 7 and I'm tired of doing that I just want to like live my life and hopefully that will be you know more outdoor activities with my family or even by myself whichever just as long as I'm outside and not in this cube <laughs> and then my third is kind of like my most important one which is growing my channel hopefully you know, my goal is by the end of 2020 to have at least 1,000 followers. I know that's not a lot for some people, but to me that's a lot just because I'm new. And I know uh, building up your your subscriber list, it's pretty difficult, especially when you're first coming out. And yeah, so hopefully, you know, you guys will add me and you guys will like the content that I'm putting out there for you guys. And I will reach that goal. And if I even reach a little bit higher, then woohoo! But yeah, that's my goal for... Those are my goals for 2020. And I know a lot of people are, you know, it's lose weight and all that stuff. But I just feel like, you know, I'm already kind of like a healthy person and I watch what I eat and things like that. That I don't feel like that's like a goal for me. It's just kind of like an everyday thing I already do anyways. So, and then also I'm giving up. This is like totally random. But I know it's not part of my list, but I just want to say it anyways. <laughs> Speaking of healthy. I'm actually giving up chips because I'm like the biggest hot Cheeto, any kind of hot Cheeto formula they have. I'm like obsessed with them. So I told myself I actually gained weight from eating so many chips. So even though I'm not trying to lose weight, I feel like maybe, you know, I need to stop with the addiction, with the hot Cheeto addiction. So I told myself that I'm not having any, any types of chips, any at all. Not even like plain like guacamole chips, nothing. So pray for me that I make it those six months because... Lord tempts me with those damn chips <laughs> but yeah guys I hope you liked this video I know it wasn't anything crazy but I just wanted to share it with you anyways and if you want to share your 2020 resolutions with me then go ahead and leave them down below thanks for tuning in and I'll see you guys next time bye